Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back. And today we have our very first hands-on of the OnePlus 9 Pro, along with some awesome things which we have touched in previous videos. But today's leak confirmed the previous ones times two. Now let's talk about the physical design overview before getting into the nitty-gritty details. So this is the very first hands-on image of the OnePlus 9 Pro. At the front we have the curved display, they seems to have dialed down the curves just a little bit as it doesn't seem like the almost waterfall display which was present on the 8 Pro, still it is very very much curved. We then retain the small hole punch camera on the top left corner, on the right hand side we have the power button and the alert slider, but guys notice, the frame starts to bulge out where the buttons start. This is very new for OnePlus, but Samsung started doing it years back with the Note 10 Plus. However, Samsung frames bulges out a bit more than what we find in the OnePlus 9 Pro. On the back we have this silver color. We for some reason don't have a matte finish on this particular color, but no problem at all, don't worry guys. This likely is a color thing. Even last year on the 8T, OnePlus had matte and glossy finishes depending on which color you choose. So there likely will be some matte finish color options on the 9 Pro. At the bottom we have the USB Type-C slot, then a speaker grill and a SIM tray. And that completes the physical overview. Now however, let's talk about the elephant in the room, which is this camera system. Basically we see a quad camera system with a flashlight, microphone and some sensors. As per the camera, this one looks like primary, ultra wide. This one over here looks like the zoom one, however I can't confirm what this fourth lens is for. It could be for some weird things like what they did last year with the color filter thing or it could be some janky ass macro camera. And then there is this thing. Hasselblad. Guys, they are legends in camera. They made cameras which were used in the first moon landing. That should tell you the caliber of Hasselblad. And usually they don't even partner with smartphone OEMs, unlike Zeiss and Leica which do a lot of partnership. And if you remember, OnePlus was rumored to have partner with Leica for the 9 Pro. However, now looks like OnePlus chose Hasselblad over Leica. And this partnership with Hasselblad further strengthens their claims of becoming the king of smartphone cameras in 2021. That is a bold claim. But now seems like they might be on to something now that they have Hasselblad on their side. Still, just having the Hasselblad name won't do wonders for OnePlus. They need to get the technology or color science from Hasselblad to actually make some difference. If they just put a Hasselblad name, that won't change anything. It would just be like Samsung saying 100x space zoom. That was it guys for today, let me know your thoughts about this new Hasselblad OnePlus 9 Pro. I will cover every OnePlus 9 Pro detail so make sure to subscribe to not miss on any of that coverage. Hit the like button guys for the Hasselblad partnering with OnePlus. You can also say hi to me over on Twitter and thanks a lot for watching.